What is up everyone? My name is Cody and this is another commentary here. I've got a FAL gameplay on Yemen. I decided to throw this class on just to uh, see how overpowered it really was and oh my gosh, it is overpowered. So that's enough about the gameplay. I kind of got, um, I think, a lot to talk about. I'm not really sure. I kind of just had an idea in my head. So I went ahead and, you know, pushed start recording. So this is going to be fun to see where this goes. See what all I actually get covered and what um, just comes out as mumbling or uh, a spare thought process that probably won't be said in this commentary. But one more thing that I forgot to touch up on. Uh, this is a 6v6 hardpoint game. I don't exactly go for the objective. Um, just kind of, you know, plan for kills. And I also I did find some boosters in this game. I, I went and ruined their fun. So, you know, this is an overall... It's an interesting gameplay, 6v6, and I get a high amount of kills, so, you know, it should be fun to watch. So, anyways, like I said, I kind of wanted to talk about um, history here on YouTube. Like I said, I probably, I'm not really sure on what I'm going to touch on. Um, for me, YouTube's kind of a touchy subject. Uh, I, I try not to say every single thing that's on my mind, but some things just, like, they trigger other things. Um, so, you know, I'm going to try to do my best, but um, what I kind of want to talk about is what YouTube used to be to me and what it is to me now and and basic ideas like that if you're following me on Twitter um, I kinda went on a little rant right before I made I'm making this video so if you don't follow me on Twitter it's always fun times um, youtube.com or sorry twitter.com slash I'm Cody with two Y's uh, most likely be a link in the description if you guys wanna check that out but anyways like I said um, I'm kinda just gonna be going on a rampage here talking about you know whatever comes to mind Let's see, what do I want to talk about? So, YouTube. Um, back in the day, I felt like Nate shot there for a second. YouTube, how the fu- No, but anyways, back in the day, I was one of the bigger YouTube channels. Um, and by back in the day, I mean pre-2010 era. Alright, sorry. Alright, sorry about that. Chabong decided to mess with me on Skype while I'm in the middle of a, middle of a video. Uh, but yeah, like I said, um, I was kind of- um, Try not to be cheesy at all, but it was kind of a big deal on YouTube back before, um, like, 2010 when MW2 took over and Machinima uh, started raining YouTube um, with their director program and stuff like that. So anyways, um, you know, I was I was pretty big with a couple thousand subscribers. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm not trying to toot my own horn, but, I, you know, people knew who I was. And that, that was back when it was, like, COD4 and Sniper Lobby. So 2008 through 2010 were pretty good years for me. Um, and... You know, I know you guys have probably heard this, or you probably are aware of this, but YouTube wasn't about the money back then. Um, nobody made money off of it. Literally, nobody made money off of it. Um, except except for Grizz, which that, that was always questionable. But anyways, so, um, yeah, back then it was all about, you know, you made videos doing what you liked, and if you got the most views, then you were so cool. Like, that's all it was. It wasn't, oh, I made so much money off of this video. No. You didn't have sponsors, you didn't have anything. Uh, maybe you ha had one person that sent you some free controller grips or some control freaks. Maybe you got a, p yeah, a pair of control freaks and, you know, that was it. There was no promo codes, nothing like that. It was maybe you got a free thing or two or maybe you got a free 60 on Microsoft points. It was all about having fun and doing what you wanted to do. And that's what that's what I loved. I mean, that's obviously why I started making YouTube videos. And, I'm, I'm again, I'm going to try not to talk about this too much because that, it might be a whole other commentary topic. Um, but... I loved it so much that it pulled me away from other things socially. Um, you know, some could say that I spent too much time, you know, playing Xbox, that, you know, it's not really socially healthy, even though, uh, lo and behold, little did they know, I was, I was doing things far more social than I was in real life. I was learning things, I was teaching myself things, I was learning about myself all while playing online and you know that's not something that the normal person sees you have to really experience it or you know come in, come in contact with it to understand how how social you can be online um, just because it's online doesn't mean it's not real and I, like I said I'm gonna try not to touch base in this too much but you know it's kinda what formed me um, I, I'm, I'm trying not I'm tr really trying not to spark another comment from myself um, but basically it really let me find who I was. Um, I went from being that asshole jock to to being somebody that, that cares about other people's emotions. That that is actually a real human being and is not just a stuck-up asshole like the other percentage of the other percentage of the high school population. Um, so you know, I I can't I can't 
I'm, I can't really. Th it's, I'm, I'm trying to personify YouTube, and it's not a thing. Or it's not a person. But I can't think YouTube enough. I guess. I mean, that's the only way that I can think of how to say it. Um, but it was my platform for for creativity. It was where it was my creative outlet. So essentially, incent, essentially. Um, but yeah, if I didn't get sappy enough right there for you, um, we had host migration. Maybe we can switch topics while we're doing that. Um, nice little transition. But yeah, basically what I'm trying to say is YouTube was a huge part of my life. And I know that sounds cheesy, and I know that sounds gay, and I know that sounds dumb, but it is. And the fact that I went from okay, like I said, I had I had a couple thousand subscribers, which means and and just to give you guys some background, um. I would get probably 150 likes per video, which I, it, it's not a lot compared to huge YouTubers, but that that was pretty big to me. Um, to think that you know I'd get like 150 150 likes and then say maybe 50 comments, 50 to 100 comments, you know, depending on how popular the video was. So that's if I post up a video, if I'm thinking about something, if I'm like, hmm, you know, I'm really I'm really stuck on the subject and I really want to talk about it, like such as this video right here, I would get say 50 replies of people who all liked my videos people who all you know maybe not even people that liked my videos but people that had a thought on the subject oh here's where i found the boosters i have a, had a thought on the subject and they made comments on you know what they thought about it or you know that maybe they just commented and said hey cody have a nice day anything like that you know it's just the interaction that i loved and the fact that i don't have that anymore kind of really really does suck um i mean and any of you guys that do watch this video thank you so much i really do i love it um i mean i, I consider all of you guys my friends obviously we don't we don't hang out like normal friends do <laughs> but i really do i care for all of your views and i care for your comments like i i mean i can't stress that enough comments are my favorite thing on youtube it's it's just how it is you know any type of feedback is good feedback in my mind um, so the fact that, you know, I can just post up a video, and I used to get hundred, not hundreds of comments, but 50, 50 to 100 comments of people that just, you know, whether or not it was anything at all, just like any type of comment was just, it was wonderful. So I guess what I'm trying to say is, uh, I don't know, I, I want to have a nice message to end this video with, um, even though the video is not exactly all the way over. But I don't really know what to end this with, other than, you know, because this is just kind of, me opening up and saying stuff it's not really anything that you guys can learn from it um i guess if i wanted to to do a, um a good little lesson at the end of the video i could say if you have a good thing don't let it go maybe something like that um but i guess the way that i feel about this is that you know i had this this wonderful platform of that where i could express myself and you know i took a break from it i felt like i didn't i felt like i didn't need it even though i mean obviously i do um but I felt like I didn't exactly need to make a video, and what that did is it dwindled my, my fan base that I had, or my, my sub counts, and that's why I currently have like 5,000 subs, and I only get 100 views on a video if I'm lucky. Um, but I guess enough bitching about the video. Um, you know, a lot of people, they don't like it when you bitch, believe it or not, um, which I feel like was why Wings Redemption doesn't get as many views as they should, even though and there's obviously other reasons there. Um, but... Yeah, like I said, if you guys watch this far, I, I cherish your views. I really do. Um, it really means a lot. If you guys want to leave a comment, that would mean so much to me. Um, but yeah, I definitely, I definitely just, I, I cherish how um, YouTube is to me. And I cherish, you know, just, just this social platform that is made here just to, you know, it was, I, I'm really trying not to sound sappy or gay or... I know I keep saying gay is a derogatory term, and, and that's not what I mean for it at all. Uh, but, but yeah, if you guys get what I'm saying, I hope that you do, because if not, that's just me rambling on for an hour or you know, ten minutes or whatever for no reason. But, yeah, uh, that's pretty much it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. You know, I'm what I'm going to try to do, is, and I hope that you guys hold me to this. I almost forgot to say this, and thank God I didn't. But I want you guys to, to hold me to a standard. I want you guys to ask me where my new videos are. That's what keeps me going. If you guys are asking me for my new videos, they will come out. Without a doubt, they will come out. This summer, I'm going to try to make videos. A lot of them. No, I'm, I'm going to. It's not that I'm going to try to. I'm going to. So 89 and 5, that's the end of this video. 
I don't know what kind of kill-death ratio that is. I can't really count right now. But thank you very much for watching. Like I said, I hope that you guys enjoyed this one. It's kind of personal to me, so, you know, if you could reflect in the comments, you know, leave a like, anything like that, that'd be absolutely wonderful. So thank you guys for watching, and I will hopefully talk to you guys soon. Bye.